All right, guys. We're here with Joe. Last case of historic autographs, Civil War, Appomattox coming at you. May the monster hit be with you. the short prints to you too. Looks like this one's got multiple documents here. Three. Alright, we'll start off with the outlaw, Jesse James. Mint nine to fifty. Nathan Bedford Forrest. This is a short print. Nine five. That's card number fifty eight. And eight five. Third Massachusetts artillery. Fifty. And our documents, we got three of them here. First one is the War Date Soldier Letter, 1863. Next up is General John Adams Dix. John Adams Dix. Last name D-I-X. Office of Corporation of Trinity Church. It is dated 1876. And then our last piece. General Frederick Townsend signed document. State of New York. Okay. Glad you got one of the SPs you needed too. Number two. Oh yeah, these pieces are awesome. It's like stepping back into time with the handwriting, for sure. No texting or tweeting or any of that. All right, base cards. We've got Surrender at Appomattox Courthouse. 50. And we have the 1861 map, the United States, 9-5. That's actually really cool. Isn't that crazy? That's all it was. Over here, not so much. And then Battle of Fredericksburg, 9-5 to 50. All right, this one's got two documents. No emoticons, definitely not. Brevet General James Alan Hardy, cut signature. James Allen Hardy. Index card there, very respectfully. And General James Negley, signed document. I've seen him before. Railroad bond. I think we've probably hit that a couple times. Next, we got an SP coming up. Not sure if you have this one or not. All right, Atlanta, 1864. I know we fit that one before. Mint nine to fifty. Jeb Stewart. Here's the SP. 9-5, that is card number 60. Card number 60. And Young Soldier, Johnny Clem, 8-5. To 50. All right, and two documents in this one. 
General Alexander Dyer. Cut signature. Alexander Dyer. And... Confederate General Sterling Price. I haven't seen this one before. That's really cool. Sterling Price. I don't think we've hit that name before. Doesn't ring a bell. Hit three of them? Let's see a stone hole auto. Alright, this is a one hitter coming up. This might be a pretty big hit. Ironclads, 9 5. 4 1 caps, boom. It's to 50. Battle of Vicksburg, to 50, 9 5. And Ford's Theater, to 50, mint 9. Alright, this is a one hitter. Admiral. David D. Porter. David D. Porter. I've definitely never seen that one before. Pretty big hit? I would think so, right? David D. Porter. Let's see if he was on the back, actually. David D. Porter. Don't see him on the back of this one. Admiral of all three boats. There you go. All right, and finish up here. 8-5, third Massachusetts artillery. All right, this is SP to 20, Benjamin Harrison, Mint 9. That is card number 47. 47. And Battle of Fredericksburg, Mint 9. All right, and the last of the documents here. So we've got three in this one. War date letter, February 26th, 1863. 1863. Followed by General Henry W. Slocum. I don't recognize that name. I don't know if you fit that one before. And the last piece, General John H. H. Ward. Oh, well, yeah, you get the whole bio on that one, too. Born June 17th, 1823 in New York, New York. Died 1903 at the age of 80. Union Army, years of service, 1842 to... 1847, New York Militia, 59 to 51 to 59, and then USA 61 to 64, Brigade General. That's pretty cool. All right, buddy. I appreciate it as always. Awesome stuff. I'll get it packed up and out ASAP. Later, Joe.